Take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction, let us show you the way. 5GE or 5G Evolution is the name that AT&T is using in areas where 4G LTE technologies like three-way carrier aggregation, 4x4 MIMO, and 256 QAM are available. Your phone has probably already been connecting to AT&T's LTE networks with these capabilities even before AT&T added its 5GE icon. Make your mark, take our lead. The iPhone 12 is Apple's first 5G-compatible smartphone. If you see just the 5G symbol, that means you're connected to standard 5G on the sub-6 GHC spectrum. This spectrum can be faster than LTE but slower than MM wave and higher frequency 5G bands. Make your mark, take our lead. Only the iPhone 12 series of smartphones, and those released afterward, support 5G. You can turn off 5G on all of these phones. Older iPhone models, such as the iPhone 11 and lower, are unable to connect to 5G. Technically, you can't turn off 5G on these devices, but that's because the hardware is not in older phones. Let's help you make your mark. The reason for this is because Verizon uses a shortcut to achieving 5G coverage, known as Dynamic Spectrum Sharing, or DSS. DSS 5G reuses parts of 4G channels for 5G. Phones will automatically prefer a 5G network over a 4G one, so Verizon customers will see that coveted 5G icon pop up. Take our lead. 5G can be faster than older types of LTE, but buying a 5G capable phone will not get you 5G when it's available. True 5G phones are available for AT&T and the network now covers the majority of Americans, but you should check your 5G coverage before upgrading. Take our lead. April 8, 2019 updated. April 9, 2019 1 36 p.m. software updates to newer Android and iOS devices that work on AT&T's advanced LTE network now show a 5GE icon, which critics say confuses the carrier's customers. Rather, what it means is that AT&T has rebranded the latest iteration of its LTE network as 5G Evolution. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.